crank the knuckles, crank the bones. Oh. oh, oh, I hope that wasn't too loud, right? I hope that wasn't too loud. This match, man, I mean, I'm, I'm, I want to say it's going to be a bloodbath. I mean, we'll probably see some swaggy shit out of these two. We'll probably see some excitement, but this is going to be, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, the Trash Talk Temple proudly brings to you the mother of the and me. This contest is scheduled for first to fight with a 20 minute time limit. Introducing our competitors first on the left hand side, representing top tier tempo. He is the saltiest scrub zero you ever see. Henchman. And new opponent representing the eight headed idiots on Team Brain Dead Bunga. He is the emo assassin, caramelized pony, who was just on the podcast with us here earlier today, and now he is ready to throw down with the maximum sweat lord himself, the saltiest scrub zero, the angriest of angers, the henchman. You love him, I, I love him. I consign you to the coldest hell. Ooh, let me put on my snowsuit. Prepare for your soul to freeze. Round one. Ooh, Fight. Henchman is a goddamn national treasure. Ladies and gentlemen, we are in for a party. Rock in the house tonight. There we go. One, two, into the overhead. Nice whip punish with the ice ball. Standing two, one. Goes for swag. Nice standing two to avoid any breakaway technology. We're gonna go back three, two, into. Hit confirmed. Two, one, boom, 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 boom. Optimal 31% and a teabag and a back three. Stagger into four, grab. Four, two, into creeping ice. Teabagged in his face and then mixed him up. I tried to tell you, ponies, man. I tried Round to tell you. Fight. You said I had no faith in you. All right, let me go back. One, four, into creeping ice. There's the conversion. Boom, standing four, one, two. Oh, my God. Jesus. 53% throw escape. Ponies is not giving up without a fight. There's a whip on his back. One, four. Oh, oh, oh. Back three, two. And the Merce, here we go, standing 4-4-2 four, four, in the... My mind's telling me no! Ponies, you're breaking my heart, man. Please, go get Collector. Ponies, get Collector! Ponies, we need Collector! We need this. We need this. Ponies, no, he's trying to rage quit like a bitch. Don't be a bitch, ponies. Go get the collector. Don't be a bitch. Go get him. You know what the people need, man. You know what the people want, ponies. They don't want this baby joker. They don't want El Yoker. You know what they want. You know what they want. Tundra. He's thinking about it. He's having an existential crisis at the moment. He's like, do collector. I want to exist? There we go. Ooh, here we go. Now, this is the matchup I was hoping for. This is the matchup I was hoping for. I was hoping for ponies to turn into Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan, right? Because this is the most patient, turtliest collector in the world. Dog, you will not open him up. I don't care what kind of mix you got. I don't even care, dog. He will 4 4 back dash, 4 4 back dash, teleport 4 4 back dash. You have no idea. Here comes the I race is on. Those greedy hands. That's one offer I'll reject. Your round one fight. All right, here we go. Starting off four four. There, Axe to start off. And there's an amplified shooting ice ice ball. There's a teleport four four. Oh, the whip punish catches the breakaway. Goes for anti breakaway technology. Nice 27% for one bar. Big damage output from Collector, and this is unescapable damage. Unescapable big time whip punish. Big time conversion. Oh, a little bit early with the breakaway catch. Slide in the nooch. Got the knockdown. Henchman playing a little bit more facetiously. Oh, no punish. No punish on the 4 4 3. Sub Zero can slide punish. No whip punish there. 4 3 with the launch into fucking dagger dance. Uh oh. 
four, 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 four in the bola. No punish. Oh, there's the punish. But Pony's going to be able to break away. Is he going to break? No, no breakaway. Pony's blocking the mix down four, four, four. Where's the, there's the extender. Oh, four, two into uppercut. Pony's, man, he's putting up a fight, though. He's putting up a fight, ladies and gentlemen. Here we are, this is the lector we wanted, the collector we needed. Slide in the nuke. Okay, cheap shit to start it, cheap shit to start. Press the buttons, got hit with a back two, back three, two, one, ponies with a one, three, hit confirm, Bola! Oh, and then he goes for the double burn. Looking at a little bit over 30% for that, four, four. He just lets it rock. Oh, missed the punish, short hop in the four, back three, two, eight, ball. Jump going back to two. Oh, this is a big conversion. Ponies didn't break out. Henchman just dropped the combo early. I don't know what the call was there. Ponies didn't have bar to escape. He could have done a big explosive combo. There's the launch. Boom. In the relic floor. Doesn't amplify. Just looking for that hit. Ponies now stagger. Four, four, three, four, four, back dash. We knew it was coming. Uh oh, unbreakable. Break away. There we go. Ponies. Oh, he's getting caught in the mix. There's a back grab. And Henchman is going to take that. But I think that Ponies with a couple of adjustments. Both of those rounds were inching pretty fucking close. We'll see if Pony Rage quits on this one. But I feel like with a couple of adjustments, man, he got some clean whiff punishes and he got some really big openings. And he actually cashed in on a lot of them. And he is now in chat. This is why we call him the emo assassin. This is why we call him the emo assassin, guys. He, he, he's, he's sad right now. He's very emotional. But you know what? If we sit there and we spam emotes and we'd be like, oh, Pony, don't be a bitch, then he'll keep on fighting on, and he may be able to turn this around if he does. It's only two to zero on Henchman, and those last tw uh, rounds that he earned, they were not easily grabbing. Inspector they were Collector. not easily grabbing. Snowman. Cotton War Camp. Oh yeah, that's right, that's right. I do I do get a lot of refreshment from these SoCal Honey Badger brand merchandises, right? You should go ahead and check out the merch store. There's a link in the comment section below, right? If you're on Twitch or YouTube, there's a fucking comment. There's, there's a link in the description. It's, it's, it's where I comment to you. Oh wait, hold on, video games are happening. No lore this time. They're like, nah man, fuck your story. There's a forward four, interrupting four or three. Interesting, I would think that four or three is a little bit uh, faster than four or four. There's a nice hit four or three, catching the ice ball in the nooch. Benz, oh nice, Benz the bar. On an amplified bola, doesn't catch it. Okay, back to short hop four. Looked like Ponies was trying to uppercut that one. And he saw the startup, and then Ponies just lets the string rock. He says, yo dude, you gotta block all of this. Uh oh, slide in the nooch. Big, oh, interrupt, big interrupt, but he didn't convert much off of it. Okay, walk, 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 four grab. Cody's now in charge of this round. As long as he maintains his defense, doesn't get opened up, right? As long as he doesn't get opened up, he doesn't have to win. He just has to make sure he doesn't lose right now. And this is where Ponies actually shines. This is where he is at his best. When he's got a life lead and he can turtle it up and just kind of poke at you, keep you in frame traps, Get tiny bits of damage, shut you down, and all the people that voted for henchmen now are starting to think Round maybe I should have. I don't know, man. I, dude, he's not the emo fucking jobber. He's the emo assassin. He does win sometimes, people. There we go. Jump two goes for the anti-breakaway technology. No punish on that. There's a four grab dashing in. What we got? No back dash. Ice ball to yeah. blow up the wake up. <laughs> Henchy of bitch ass dookie butter. Ooh, Henchy of bitch ass dookie butter confirmed. Some people not a fan of the saltiest Sub Zero in the world. I happen for one thing that salty Sub Zero is one of the national treasures of America. Here we go, jump kick, nice jump kick. 4-4, four, 4-4 four, four, four again. No anti air. Ooh, ponies with the air to air conversation. Here we go, whip and grab. Stay looking for grabs. Even when they whip, nice neutral jump. Jump kick back there. Four, four, there's the launch! Okay, Ponies, he's working on that life lead. He goes for buttons in the news. Oh my god. Ponies, a couple of dropped opportunities was right there. Here we go. Here we go. Backing it up. Backing it up. 74. 74 again. 74. No. Gets a flawless block on that. Forward, forward, down one. Forward grab. Ponies getting uh, getting in the mix train. There's a big punish. Oh, barely mistimes it. No punish, though, from Henchman. 
both of these guys are overextending a little bit. Uh, shorty hop, shorty hop too, and I don't get nice neutral jump to blow up. Blow up buttons, and now Pony starting to get out of the corner. Gets hit with a slide for the whiff punish on the forward four or four three. Big punish, no. Pony getting a forward grab. Doesn't go for a big punish. Teleport now on neutral jump punch to catch the teleport was scouted. Henchman saw it coming back three into the slide. This is it, no bar to escape. Ponies can give them this whole biscuit barrel. Boom, into fatal blow. This is gonna be good for at least 40 points. Collector's damage doesn't scale a whole lot after Relic Lore. So if he does something after, there we go, 38, close to 40%. Relic Lore, like, does a lot of damage without being scaled. There was a big punish there are not a big, yeah, there's a big punish. He punished Relic Lure with a 4-2-4. Four, four. Did henchman, so. Pony's on the verge of making that comeback. He was close. All right. And what I was saying is that Collector's Fatal Blow, it don't scale so hard in combos. It does scale, but it don't scale so hard, and Relic Lure doesn't cause a lot of scaling. So Relic Lure can lead to a lot of fucking damage. Lot of fucking, and if you can catch a breakaway with that, you just your health bar is deleted. <laughs> your health bar is deleted. All right, what's Pony's thinking? What's his thinking? Uh, what's his thinking going on right now? He's talking in chat that he's looking for maybe a different variation. Gonna swap out teleport. Sub Zero. Interesting. Interesting. There seems to be some debate and consternation amongst the chat between Bunga and the Temple. They seem to be in disagreement as to who's going to win this. I will say this. Ponies is at zero right now, but he was getting close with Collector. And each round, he so got a little played. bit close. Oh, this is the other one. This is the other one. Stand down. Ponies, he's got three characters that he can let it rock with. One of them's Kotal. We may see that later. We just saw Collector. Joker's a new thing. He just started Joker, all right? But his third character, the waifu of the military, the military waifu. Scone your brain. Round Onision one. extraordinaire. Here we go. Sub Zero versus Ono Onision. Here we go. Back one to four. Back one. Oh, he messed up the conversion on that. I don't know what ponies was trying for. This is the overhead. Anti air standing one. Back three, two, one. There's a grab attempt. Well, not a grab attempt. Try to do the parry. All right, back three, two, four, four. Not respecting the plus on that. And there's the launch. Cross up into amplified ice ball 30% and the corner ooh, ooh 18% on that and there's a wake up button ponies getting caught ponies messing up oh there's some executional errors we're getting anti it seems like he's having an adjustment period he needs to warm up with sonya round two fight all right, all right there's air ice balls block Keeping ice, four, two, keeping ice, down one, down one. Uh oh, and he's out. He's got the corner. Sonya in the corner is pretty nasty. Uh oh, getting caught with the ice ball. There's a side swap, the most ice, or not ice, uh, amplified slide. Okay, Onision. Anti, anti head, Onision, overhead, Onision. There's the crushing blow. I don't know how Henchman got caught with that. Ponies now with the four grab. He can get his offense started. There's the cancel into projectile baiting the amplification keeping himself uh allegedly safe no punish there at a henchman that is very very much unsafe catches a short hop on wake up with an ice ball and we go back three two one four four or four three sorry into a down poke into a grab here comes the overhead again back dash block in the mix didn't block that one break away wake up buttons no he jumped uh-oh, short hop, short hop in the grab, and that's going to be all she wrote for Henchman taking that one. Once Ponies was able to get started, he was able to get a little bit of offense in, but it looked like he got shut down pretty quickly, and once Henchman got the corner again, it all started rolling downhill. Eight respect for the brutality. We'll see if uh, Ponies will continue to fight on. This is like in the match where he, he just did the finishing move, and the ref's like, what? Two, and then when you see Ponies has left the game, three, but when Ponies selects a character, two, right? Let's see where it goes. Oh, we are getting some lag here. 
some technical difficulties. He's moving his cursor. There's some Kendra. life in him. There is life in him yet, boys. Chosen dude. Oh, Luke Kang. This is another character. Pony, he plays a lot of characters. He actually plays a lot of characters. And and quite competently as well. So we'll see what he does with Liu Kang here. He does use the zoning Where capabilities of Liu Kang to their moves. maximum benefit. But this is Henchman, man. He just kind of jumps in and does fucking mix-ups and it turns into badass combos. I mean, I've seen it happen before. You've seen it happen before. Ponies now. On the verge of an 0-5 Freedom Fighter, he is letting it roll the dice Round with Liu Kang. He is going to make the reversal 5-0. Here we go back. 1-4 with the Ice Ball Jump Kick cross up. And 2 is the mix up. Okay, 4-3-3, three, three, down 1, block, 4-4, four, 4-4, four, 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 down 1, no. 2-1-2, two, two. out of Henchman, amplified low ball. Pony's getting his first hit on the board, doesn't have a regular low ball. Answers with a slide on Wake Up Shorty Hop 2. There's a short hop 2 out of Ponies as well. He's like, I do that shit. And let me get this crush. Go ahead and press buttons. 28%. Ponies not as a light lead, but that's going to disappoint or disawake. Disappear. Disappear on that whiff punish. Ponies blocking the ice ball amplified. All right. Match is a little bit close. Starting to close the gap, though. All right, 4 2. Into creeping ice board. Now we have the corner. Ponies doesn't really have side swap ability, but he's got wall carry. So if he can get a touch in the amplified bicycle kick, he can get out of here, but not getting trip guarded for the back one. Back one for a full combo. Looking for buttons. Ponies now with an amplified fireball. Should have really hit confirmed in the bicycle kick. But here we are, still stuck in the corner. There's a low to blow up the parry. Pony trying to make the read, but it's scrub zero. Forward grab, or no, back grab. Odd, you don't see those out of scrub zero very often. Right. Fireball, Pony's is out, he is out. Look at the gets trades with that low fireball. Back three, two, there's a shimmy, back three, two. Uh-oh, up three, up three, here we go. Uh-oh, uh -oh. one, two, three, two, ice ball on the chip. He knew there was no more health left. There's a Merce. Is he going to Merce? Yeah, Ponies usually puts his controller down. He did not. He did not. Ponies is walking forward. He's like, please, end it now. End it now. And then Henchman tried to end it with a swag-ass combo, and he fucked it up. Your final score today. Oh, and five. Freedom Fighting. Freedom Potion. Henchman over Ponies. Henchman, the saltiest. Scrub Zero, we know. There's no saltiness in this match. That was some quite impressive play. That's why I keep telling you guys, man, Henchman is no slouch. He will run through a lot of the competition here on his way to getting the championship belt, the superior nooch hooded sweatshirt within which one will wear to the club to pick up skeezers and airheaded ass breezers. Indeed, if you want to join us live, you can do so at twitch.tv slash SoCal Honey Badger. Go ahead and come over and smoke some stuff. Cigarettes, probably, allegedly, legally cigarettes, legally. Okay, okay. And then like, comment, and subscribe. Tweet that shit to your mom, man. She's invited too. She is definitely invited.